and Santa. <laughs> <Tenere. laughs> Zoom. Oh, yeah. Zoom. Yeah. Yeah. You can do a panorama, by the way, if you want to. These uh, houses were built. Uh, there's no roads to bring them up. Oh, they've got someone's this side there, aren't they? Uh, well, some of those have been the same. Yeah, I would have thought so. Well, this is the north of Tenerife. A bit like the Italian. Yeah. And uh, you can see the houses in the bottom there. These are the houses that were built by hand. Well, look at the cultivation, there's a guy down here cultivating, he's got water things and then there's yeah. and then there's something else being grown off out the hillside there almost it's like cabbage. Right, so. well, these are vines actually down there, aren't they? Aren't they? they look yeah. like vines. I think we need to have we? Yeah. we need to to go. Here we are in the north part of uh, Tenerife, just past a village called Tagana. And at the end of the um, pool we've got the fish, we've got one. A little tipler. That won't get in the... Very pretty looking fish. You're up. Very pretty. Nice to give it Blue, this sea, is it? Here we go and have a look at that artisan shop. Yeah. And this is Pico de la Vengueuse, Hayes Point, and uh, the Tenerife. And we're down there on the other side is some Cruz. And over there is Laguna. In 1684 to 97. Tall towers added in the late 19th century. In the dark interior of the church are many Baroque statues, sculptures, sorry, the work of the local artist Fernando Estevez and Jose Luan Perez, a well known island artist. There's also paintings by Louis de la Cruz. The Cathedral's organ was bought from London in 1814 and a bust of Square here in. Hugging the shoreline 
this square was laid out in 1992 but it's based on 18th and 19th century European ta style town planning. And that cross was a it's monument. A monument to the Civil War. The Civil War, wasn't it? Yeah. The Iglesia San Francisco. This is the Franciscan Abbey founded around 1680. It was restored and extended in the 18th century and acquired two naves and a coffered ceiling, as well as an additional chapel named Capiella de la Orden Teresa. Inside the Abbey Church is a fine 17th century Norman sculpture with beautifully painted decorations. The chapel, which was closed in the mid 19th century, was reopened in 1869, at which time it became the parish church. All right. Island, carved in white Carrarian marble and unveiled in 1787, it's the work of the Italian master Antonio Cinovelli. Okay, well, it looks like it's been cleaned up in this picture. And there's the overlooking, now overlooking the golf course, as you can see in the distance. Two contrasts, isn't it? Can we take a picture of that vineyard? You can see some vineyards there. And a crater. And out there is the sea. Very still, very quiet day. Half an hour, okay? Terra, the church of the Lady of the Pines. <coughs> and the street going away from that with its various balconies and colourful prosaic squares. Terrasa de Bolivia, de Bolivar. Simon Bolivar, the founder of Bolivia. His wife came from here. town of Arucas. In a minute I'm just going to film the um, church on the other side. This church was built from 1909 to 1977. Um, very gothic in style, not in keeping with a lot of the rest of the Canaries but nonetheless 
still quite nice. And the church again from the front of Aruka. Yes, in trouble. From the balcony, this is Gran Canaria, and it's Las Palmas to Gran Canaria, and this is the port. We've been up there this morning, and at lunchtime we went across to this place over here by the port, by the red building. Pass there. And then we lunch. Weather partly cloudy. Can do with it clearing, but quite nice. And here we are in Arasif in Anzarote. Time just after seven o'clock. Got the put of the harbour. This is the first time we've managed to get a really decent sunrise. Arrecife. Sunny morning, Tuesday morning. Done a walk from the boat. Quite a long walk as you can probably see. And we've got two boats in there. There's our independence of the seas. And there's the um, something. What's the other boat called? Adventure. Adventure of the seas. Don't know where that's come from but we'll find out. And here's the church of San Giles in Arasi, in the nice market square. And the two boats, the Independence of the Seas and the Adventures of the Seas, both here in Asarif, Lanzarote. Arif. 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 There's the docks. I'm watching the, uh, what are they called? I am doing, in a minute, with their bargain uh, perfumes and the bragging presents for our little girlies and some other belts for our little girlies' boyfriend. We're back at the boat with the independence of the seas and the adventures of the seas. Day nine on our balcony, 
over to the coast of Spain, that's on the other side of Portugal, uh, riding towards Vigo. You can see the sort of mountains in, in the distance from around, and uh, of it's another sunny day. of the seas. Well, I think I can see where Paul is now. Yeah. Am I looking the right way? I'm looking my... Above the last lifeboat. Above the last lifeboat. Oh, third in over the last lifeboat. Have a look. Have a look at my screen. Right. Uh, yeah, uh, yes, yeah, well, there. There. So he's there, That's he is. Paul. Yeah, so our room's there. <laughs> and you can... A cabin. And the centre of Vigo. And this is the view from the Citadel, built by Look the floor, El Castro. So viewed out to sea, to the port. Now why are we spewing out so much junk out of our <laughs> funnel as we stopped? I don't know. Those must be the um, cockle beds, that, uh, oyster beds out there. Can you see them in the bay? Yeah, yeah. They can. Oh, it's very pretty. <laughs> Next time the boat will be docked. We'll be in Southampton and we'll be back home.
And there's, we think that's built, which is here. I'm out here. Well, we don't know about the note now, but we know that. And it's a PO boat. It's a PO boat. We need to bear that thing just like us. Time to no, no, well, I suppose it isn't. Well, yeah, no, it's a bit of a tip, but just to. This is our stateroom. And there is the, the settee. <laughs> and there's the bed, which looks a bit of a mess because we're packing to go home. Boo -hoo. Boo -hoo. And there's the, the balcony. <coughs> and the battery's just about to peg out. <laughs>